What's going on guys? Bobby with Consumer Time Capsule back with another review for you here. And today, as promised a couple days ago, we are back at Sonic and that's because they've got two more interesting things that they just came out with and this time it's on the drink menu. We're talking about slushes. We got a Red Bull slush and a Cherry Limeade Red Bull slush. So pretty interesting. In, in one way, we're kind of maintaining the full Red Bull flavor in slush form. In the other way, we've got the classic cherry limeade that Sonic is so well known for um, in slush form combined with Red Bull. So this is for all you energy drink lovers out there. So, uh, you know, I wish it was a bang. I wish it was a bang slush, but you know. I don't think anybody really knows what that tastes like yet. <laughs> Cheers, guys. I'm going to start with the uh, with the classic. I think the re the regular Red Bull seems like the way to start things off. Now these are two dollars and ninety nine cents each for a small, three ninety nine for a medium, and I think four ninety nine for a large. So a little bit more pricey than the normal slush options, but Red Bulls are expensive. True. I mean, I just bought one. It's two dollars and fifty cents for like an eight ounce can or something. Not a low price energy drink. <laughs> so let's see what their uh, slush tastes like. With your wings? What if it came with chicken wings? Oh, that would be awesome. You know, it is a dis it is a distinctly Red Bull flavor, but. You really lose appreciation for how important the carbonation is in like what makes Red Bull taste so distinctive. You know, you wouldn't think it really affects taste all that much. But it definitely does because this is flat. It's just ice and Red Bull flavoring. Ryan, Ryan, why don't you take a sip of that and see if you agree there. I'm going to eat this cherry in the meantime. It's like a bar late at night. Mm hmm Yeah, when they pour it out of the little spout and it's not, you know, it's not quite what you expect from a Red Bull can. Mm. It is a little bit like that. That's a good point. Yeah, I'm not complaining. It's yeah, good. it's not bad. Very syrupy. Very syrupy and just syrup and ice. <laughs> yeah. I expected some carbonation. I really did. Brain freeze. In brain freeze. I already got that. All right, so here is the cherry limeade Red Bull slush. That is what it looks like, as I'm sure you could imagine. Let's right. see how the balance of flavor is going to be here. Cherry limeade's a pretty strong flavor. I'd be curious to see if Red Bull can cut through. It's struggling. Yeah. <laughs> a lot of lime. A lot of cherry. Just a very subtle hint of Red Bull. It is in there. But if you would have told me this is just a regular cherry limeade and I didn't know that a Red Bull slush combo existed, I I wouldn't have I wouldn't even notice the difference. I really wouldn't have. I mean really that's not even such a bad thing. It, you know, the cherry limeade at Sonic is one of the most reliable things in the book. I would take the cherry limeade mimosa certainly over, over this. Um, let's see here. Yeah, that, that thing needs more Red Bull. Don't you oh, think? Yeah. I it's a lot of cherry limeade flavor. But one way that this uh, this really brings something unique to the table is is that gimmick. So gimmick grade, I'm gonna have to give it an eight out of ten. I think it's a really strong idea to take an energy drink and make a Sonic slush out of it. It's just not something that you really expect, and uh, I think it's a good partnership for both brands. I really do. I think that one's gonna drive the other, and I think that that uh, is really what it's all about. Now, ranking these two in a capsule countdown for taste. See, it's funny because even though it accomplishes its goal more, I think that the second best tasting slush is actually the Red Bull slush. <laughs> I think, but it's not really fair. Like, 
If you want something that tastes like Red Bull, this is number one, and there is no number two, right? But if you want something that just is a great tasting slush, Cherry Limeade slush at Sonic is just really, really hard to beat. So I'm gonna give second place to the Red Bull slush, but hey look, obviously they did a great job nailing the Red Bull flavor, even if that carbonation is missing. That's really what's holding this thing back. I'd like to see some bubbles in this, if I could help it. I loved it, I loved it. I'm sorry, I mean, look, I'm, I'm, I'm not saying it's bad, but Cherry Limeade is, is definitely more, more my flavor. So um, I'm going to give, yeah, I'm going to give it second place on today's count, the capsule countdown, the regular uh, Red Bull slush. I'm going to give it a seven out of 10. Nice. So not too bad for, uh, for a second place offering. First place, I, I do have to cap it at seven and a half. I can't give it a, a landslide victory because I would like some Red Bull. I'd like some extra Red Bull flavor oh, in here. So why don't I just pour some of it in here? But um, it is still really, really good because you get, you get the cherry limeade experience here at Sonic and that's what it's all about. But just like with Natter Days, sometimes if you want it better, <laughs> you gotta make your own. So let's... That combo. See, now that's that's closer to what I'd expect out of it. Yeah, try to um, suck off the just like the very top half, <laughs> <laughs> and uh, and let me know. Can you can you taste the Red Bull in that? It still has some difficulties cutting through, but it's in there. Barely. Yeah. That limeade covers all. It does. It's it's a tough it's a tough flavor to cut through, Is and there I think that that's kind of. In the Red Bull, yeah. I mean, in this beverage. Yes, there's definitely caffeine. Yeah, this is, a, this is an energy drink from Sonic. So yeah, this is not just Red Bull flavored. It does have caffeine. I should have seen how much caffeine it does have. I'll put that in the comments. So check out the comments. And um, also check out the last review that we did of the two King's Hawaiian Club sandwiches that they have at Sonic now. And of course, until next time, I will miss you guys until I see you. Cheers.